All right, guys, listen, we have to leave our house right now. This is a state of emergency. All right, guys, so we can't stay in this house no more. Oh, yeah, yeah. We have to leave. It is what it is, though. So, again, we have to vacate the premises. We all so sad. London has school tomorrow. So much going on, man. Too much. day 11 and guys today was supposed to be the day we um, do a photo shoot <clears throat> but unfortunately we have to cancel it because an emergency came up guys and right now we have to leave this house guys take a look at that before you tell them oops no you guys don't know why <laughs> talk to them baby so what happened is it's our first time buying a home where it runs on like septic propane. and propane. Uh huh. We don't really know how that works. <laughs> so I guess I would gas run out today. <laughs> yeah, and today is a Sunday, guys. So it's really hard to take a shower because everything is cold. I can't get, my, I can't do my hair. So, you know, guys. Um, I was telling him, let's just stay in a hotel mm -hmm. and then tomorrow we can do the photo shoot. I don't know if you reached out to your photographer. I did. So I'm waiting for him to get back to me and I cancel, I cancel the appointment. So, go ahead. So that means when he gets back to you, then you book it? Yeah. Uh -huh. okay. Hopefully we can do it before Thursday. That's, That's all that matters, uh -huh. yeah. So, so guys, tomorrow would definitely have to be the mm -hmm. day. And I'm excited for that. I'm excited. I don't feel like I can't do the photo shoot. I feel like I can. Mm -hmm. And I think it's so cool to do like the photo shoot in my very last, last trimester. Like only a couple days left. That is a real full blown belly at nine plus months. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be super excited, guys. Yes. I just, I literally just take a cold bath. I know. I went in the shower, I took a cold bath, guys. So there's no hot water in the house right now. There's no um, gas coming from the stove. There's no heat in the south, period. So basically, it's so our first time, like my baby said, right? And not only that, today's Sunday, so I called them. They said, since I don't have an account with them, which I should have did that, it just been so much going on that I haven't set up an account. But I didn't know the gas was going to be done that fast. It would finish really, really fast. Yeah, but the thing is, like, I don't even know how that works. Like, yeah. So I want to see how big my uh -huh. propane tank is. That's number one. Because I'm definitely going to upgrade it if it's too small. I don't mm -hmm. like that. It can't, like, gas cannot just run out like that. That's crazy. It's gas only been like a month. Yeah, it's November been like, 5th. Yeah, it's been like a month. Yeah. Almost so, a month. So it's like. It could last maybe, anywhere from one month to. Yeah, I, mean, I think it's like a monthly thing. Like, our other house, like a monthly. We pay, pay for gas monthly. Oh, I see. Yeah. It makes sense. Pay, pay for gas monthly in the other house, but that was public. So, like, they automatically do it. So, we never run out of gas. So, we automatically pay every month. But this one, we have to schedule for them to come out to come refill our tank. So whenever it's low, and the gas tank is outside underground, so I have to get the time to check it to see that it was low. But unfortunately, we don't guys. know how to do that yet. We're learning. We're learning, guys. So this is our first time, like I said, having a house with septic. So we have a septic tank, and we have we have, um, well water, and also we have um, propane. So nothing is coming from the public. We're so far up in the hills, guys. They don't, they don't run no pipeline up here to get it from the public We're public really line. Far. We're far all the like, way up. Even when we bring our garbage out, mm -hmm, it's far. I cannot walk that. 
So I don't want you guys to think like something wrong with the house. Nothing wrong with the house, just that we wasn't responsible enough because we had too much going on. So it's a learning lesson. Yeah, and we'll live and we'll learn. Baby comes. Mm -hmm. Well, I would have took my baby out of the, out of the house and went to a hotel anyway. <laughs> right now we're going right now. Look. So the kids don't know that's a problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So um, also Ashley is with us. Uh -huh. and since we're going down tomorrow, she says she's gonna stay with us. Okay. Do, you know, so that's fun. And um, I really, I really feel sad because my house is so nice. I don't want to go to a hotel. <laughs> but now I have to pack soap. You know, wash my hair, shampoo. Mm -hmm. That's boring. I don't like yeah, that better part. pack your bags. So, God, listen, stay tuned. It does been, it does constant drama going on with us right now. Constant problem. It's like, but that. you know, it's part of life. We live and learn. I think most of the time we learn when we go through like stuff like this. Yeah. So this would never happen again, guys. I learned my lesson. Yeah. So the company is coming out tomorrow, and uh, yeah. Yeah. So the company is gonna come out tomorrow, and what time? Um, they come in early in the morning. Open at eight. Okay. So the first thing in the morning, they're gonna come out here. So we gotta be here in the morning. To, um, well, we have to take London to school anyway. Yeah, so. exactly. So. And we live around a lot of nice hotels. Mm -hmm. So I'm yeah. gonna look for some. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty exciting. But yeah, man, I, I didn't know. And my husband used to tell me. So look what my husband used to tell me, babe. We need to turn off the we need to turn off the gas when we leave. Yeah, we, we left it on. I keep telling her. I mean the heat. And I'm like, we're gonna come into a cold home. Are you out of your mind? I noticed that our house is really, really um it has really top notch stuff in here. Mm -hmm. Including like the um thermostats and everything. So he looks at it, he was like there's just no way I can't heat my house up from outside. He starts looking up the thermostats. He's like, oh my God, we can. We can heat it up right before we come to the house. But the lady's still logged in, never gave us the information. So we can't even create an account with mm -hmm. our thermostats so we can heat it up before we come in. We have to call him tomorrow. Wow, look at this hair. But God, listen, we have a, a fireplace. We should light it up. Let's buy some hoods and light up a fireplace. That's what the fireplace is for. The fireplace is for us to heat up the home. So we have fireplaces here and downstairs. So we got two fireplaces. So guys, as you guys know, I'm a city girl. I've never in my life used a fireplace. <laughs> I know. Maybe my husband has more than me because he did stuff in the woods in Jamaica. Like he will cook and he will burn wood. Yeah. I never did any of that. The thing, that, the thing is that we just need to but like... I um, gas. I was... Oh, was gas? This one looks like gas. Yeah? Look at it. Oh, oh yeah, I see the line. That's yes. gas. Yeah, you're right. So, so, guys, it's gas. I remember they saying that. So, the fireplace is also gas, too. But that's where it is. Because fireplace should be where, just in case you don't want to use gas, you, um, you put logo in there. God, we're still learning the house. This is the first time having this big house. It's a, it's a lot going on. And so, then we have, um, I don't think downstairs is gas. Oh, so downstairs we could use. We could use what? All right, so. But I don't know how I feel about that because I never did it. And I'm not saying I'm not going to, but I'm rather an experienced person. All right. But you think that if you eat up downstairs, you need to sleep in a room comfortable, so. There's a heat in a room. That's crazy. So it's just crazy. Like I told you guys, I've never used any of this stuff. And I'm always so used to like, I don't care how much my bill comes out as long as we warm and my mm -hmm. husband is cool with that. He's like, alright, whatever, leave the heat on all day if you want, I don't care. Leave the heat on, you run out of gas. I'm like, unless we go to our other house, mm -hmm. instead but of a hotel, no but then there's no beds. And I'm like, that's a lot uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. So So right now, guys, we're about to head out to... Um, we're going to be eating out. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna stay in the hotel. What a vacation day. Oh, this is like a vacation day, right? Vacation and it's Sunday. And it's snowing. So let, let me show you guys. Um, hold on. Alright. All right. So as you guys can see, it's snowing right now. It's like snowflakes. But anyway, um. So anyway, guys, I do want to say that if you guys do have experience on like 
this type of uh, septic septic and stuff like that you can let me know because i had no experience whatsoever it's so funny because when my husband was reading about the house and he was telling me about this i was like absolutely not we're not getting the house we're not getting the house he was like are you crazy people live like that every day i'm like really it just makes sense because the house he the explained to me the house is so far away from the public line you know he was like liana we live like literally if you build a house in the damn woods where the hell do you think you're gonna get any of that access so it's really new for me and i know a lot of people live on septic and all that stuff you have you guys have to like fill us in just a little bit yeah you guys so definitely <laughs> If you um, have mm -hmm. So I'm learning day by day as the tension they come out. I keep acting and stuff like that. So they help me. So I called the uh, the boiler company. He came out today, and he was telling me that the gas is um, done. So that's what happened. He said the pressure was too low to light up the furnace. So um, okay. we have a little bit of gas left to cook. Soon it's gonna run out on the stove as well. So. Wow, mm -hmm. this is crazy. This okay, is super crazy. So, in order for the um, furnace to be hot, it mm -hmm. needs to be at a 10%. 10, 10, uh, he said 10, coming at 10 pressure. 10. He said right now coming at 3. Ooh. So, it's really low, so we need gas in this house. So, <laughs> this is the only thing I don't, I don't like. I wish I just, but I talked to the company, they said once I have an account with them, and they I'm gonna remind you, right? Yeah, it's like an automatic thing, so this ain't gonna happen again. Guys. Just that we haven't signed up for switch over thing in our account already, and all that. So we should have did that, but I, I didn't expect it to be done that fast. Me either. And guys, let me tell you, it was so freaking hot in this house, mm -hmm. everybody kept complaining. Yeah, my kids, everyone, oh, mom, close my vents. I had to close all of yep. these vents, close these vents, do this, do that, do this, do that, and now look at us look at us now i mean it was hot in here I, maybe we had it too high or something <laughs> it was booming in here it felt like 80 degree weather like a song yeah, it was really hot and then um this happened but we've been here a month so and even when the lady left mm -hmm. she was leaving the heat on yeah mm -hmm. remember? i remember yep i remember so it was a lot so now we know and it happened guys another day i don't know if we're going to be able to really do this photo shoot Let's see if the photograph, the, the photograph of guy is available tomorrow. I know he got school too and I stuff know. like that. So um, we're gonna try our best, but if if we don't get it done, we do it. Yeah, we do. But we so. set it on a timer. We uh -huh. try to make it happen. Right. So we all make things happen. But, but we could we could rent the place still. Uh -huh. All right. So let's surprise these kids. Let's tell all them right, what we're doing. Come on. Come on. All right. Come on. Kids. Yeah. London. Pack your bag. We're leaving. Where you got that? Guys, don't mind the line. I was doing some work. Well, kids. Yeah. Where you at? Right here in the kitchen. Pack your bag. Come over here. Come over here. Come on. Come on, guys. Yeah, So, I want you guys to go pack your bag right now. We're leaving. Tell us why. You guys not cold? No. You not cold? Tell us why. Are you cold or not? No. Say so if you're not cold, we're not leaving then. I'm cold. Say so if you're cold, why you got scarf on in the house if you're not cold? I'm cold. So, how you feeling, baby? Good? All right, listen, back your bag, guys. Tell us where we're going. We better go to a hotel right now. Why? We're, we're staying out there for the night. The house is Man, too cold. The house is bad now. You stay not excited. I know, I know. <laughs> the yeah, house used, is bad now. They used to be excited. We're going to a hotel, guys. We're going to like a small little hotel. And we're going to spend the night, okay? So go pack your bag. Mm. <laughs> I thought you guys would be excited. What's going on? Mm, you guys, are, but... What, what? Guys, I'm sorry, they're not heating this hotel right now. Yeah. Wait, right, Daddy, we we're going to hotel for the night, guys, because it's too cold. I'm sorry, God. Uh, so we're gonna, we're gonna. Yeah, boom, boom, boom. What part is it? Um, close by. What's the house? What's the house? I see. Okay. How many minutes away? I wanna know. I'm, I'm booking right now. Wait, guys, I'm mm -hmm. excited. Wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, talk to me. Wait, we don't have no bags mm -hmm. to pack. Go pack your bag right now. We don't have no bags. Go pack your bag. It's in your room. You can stay like that. Pack your book bag. Loyal. Yeah. All you need is I'm so excited, guys, because I have a. Guys, I'm a bottle. So, guys, we love you guys. It's a lot going on in Lord from your home, man. Every day is something new. Some food. We're gonna get like a two bedroom hotel, mm -hmm. and we're gonna we're gonna live life. Every day is something new, man. 
more money, spending more oh, problems. This is our mini hmm. I guess they're right. More money, more problem, right? Yeah. <laughs> yes. Listen, guys, we're gonna talk to y'all soon. The kids gonna be ready right now. I'm gonna pack my bag and gonna head out. So, see y'all soon. Peace out. So, guys, I I wanted to record me packing my bag a bit. So, my dad said we're staying for one day, so I have to pack like three or two clothings because you never know if we have to like change and stuff or like you spill something on your clothes so i'm not just gonna pack like one outfit i'm gonna pack like two outfits to three outfits okay so this is the bag i'm gonna use you guys can't see the room yet all right what bag are you gonna use okay good you can show them inside the closet okay. right mm -hmm. okay so my closet has always been the same what bag should I use, Dad? Um, use that bag. That bag is good. This bag is good. Mm -hmm. So I have a lot of bags in here, and I'm gonna take them out because we don't need them right now. And now we gotta pack the clothes, and we gotta cover you guys again. And just so the dresser because they have okay. to do a house tour. Okay. So. We already took a shower. I think I might pack, what should I pack, like? Pack like pajamas, um, <laughs> panties and bras, and you need a rag and towel, you need um, soap, toothbrush, toothpaste, you need um, whatever you need. Whatever you need. Okay, we don't need soap. Oh, don't take our soap? But Mama always start, like to bring her own soap, so. I'll pack it, maybe. So guys, I can't really find matching PJs, like I have a snack Oh, you got a snack shot? I didn't know it. Ha! Thank you for blowing yourself up. <laughs> Alright, so. I'm gonna hide it again. While you pack your bag, I'm gonna go pack mine, okay? Um. I'm gonna go. Yes. Go pack. I don't have no magic PJs, guy. Oh. Should I bring out my jeans or not? Yeah, that jeans is good. And bring your clothes and your book bag for school tomorrow. Okay, you got, you got school tomorrow. Are we still going to school? Yeah. What do you think? We didn't go on vacation? We're not going on vacation. Please, can I not go to school? Why? Please, it's going to be too much. Why is it going to be too much? We're not going to go far away from the hotel. How many minutes away is it? It's going to be near. We're going to do our hotel How near. How many minutes away? I wouldn't know yet. I'm going to book it right now. No, but you still got school. It's not a vacation. No, Dad, please, no. You still got school. No, Daphne, no. Still got no, I don't want to do school. You have please, to. No. You have to. Please, Dad, no. I don't want yes, to. Yes, you do. No, please. You have to. Yeah, it's not a vacation. Please, Dad. It's a staycation. But your house is like cold, so. No, Dad, please. All right, I'll think about it. All right, guys, listen. I'm packed and ready. Are you packed? Yes. All right. Yes. Guys. It's cold. It's excited because it's snowing outside. That's crazy, guys. Look at all the snow. It's snowing a lot, guys. So, it is a snowy day. So, that means it's extra cold inside. Not that cold on snowy days, thank God. But yeah. The day after the snowy day. The house is cold, man. It's gonna be icicle. Mm hmm. So the kids are coming down right now, guys. She's one, the one is down. Who's that, London? Nope. No, that's hey, London. Scarlet, first. Oh, where's Scarlet at? Oh, Scarlet. Oh, over there, I didn't see her. You got your bag packing ready, London? Yep. All right. She's ready. What are you bringing? Me? Yeah, what, what are you bringing? Um, a school I have outfit. So my clothes, um, outfits, um, this bag full of my essentials. Okay. Um, and I'm making my school bags. All right, Scarlett, come here, baby. Come here, baby, come. How you feeling? You excited to go to the hotel? You're not gonna sleep at home today? So don't cry that you wanna come home. Don't say, I wanna go home. <laughs> don't say that, okay? <laughs> She's on her iPad, guys. So listen. Uh, we're heading out right now. Stay tuned. We're gonna show you guys the hotel. It's gonna just for us to scratch tonight till I sleep tonight, man. So we have to like fit into the circumstance of what's going on right now. But it's not it's temporary. Tomorrow thing gonna be back to brand new again and this is a learning learning lesson for us. So thank you baby. I love you guys, gonna see y'all soon. Peace out. Alright guys, listen, we have to leave our house right now. This is a state of emergency. Yeah. We all are gonna head out of our house right now and leave. We have to vacate the, vacate the premises. That's what they say, yes. right? Yes, let's vacate the premises, guys. <laughs> Alright, guys, so we can't stay in this house no more. Oh, yeah, yeah. We have to leave. It is what it is, though. Yeah. But come on. What a day. What yeah, a day. Guys. So, again, we have to vacate the premises. We're all so sad. 
London has school tomorrow. I have a photo shoot, but let's do it. There's too much going on, man. Too much. It's a snowy day, but guess what? It's still a blessing, man. It's still a blessing. It's still God's showers on us the same way. Come on, Scarlet. Let's get in the car. All right, guys. Stay tuned. We're about to head to the hotel right now. See y'all soon. What's up, guys? So, we're finally in a hotel. Right now. My husband is really man down. I think the fever has officially attacked his body. And I have to take care of him, guys. But in this hotel, it's not bad. I'll give you guys a little room tour in a few. But my husband's man down. I want him to eat, take some medicine, and lay down for now. But it's officially got to him like it got to me. Check him out. <laughs> Babe, tell him how you feel. He <clears throat> gotta go to the bed for sure. You wanna go to the bed? Help you out? Mm -hmm. You wanna go to the bed? No, no, Okay, guys, so he wants to eat. But so while he's there, I'll show you. This is the room. It's a nice room, nice size. And then over here. We have a bathroom, pretty sink. We have a nice kitchen, dining table, living room area. I put the heat on for him. Then we have another room over here. And as you guys know, <laughs> yeah, that's them. As you guys know, we have another sink and another bathroom. It's really nice and roomy. Can't complain. But guys, my husband is feeling how I was a couple days ago. So right now, I'm going to get off this camera. Give him some food. Make sure he drinks some medicine. A lot of water. And then I'm going to get back to you. How you feeling, Scarlett? Good. I wish I could like say my shoe pants You took your shoes off, off already? Yeah, because I'm on me. Oh man, I wish I brought I brought you slippers. Let yeah. me let me get your slippers, okay? Thank you, mommy. Okay. So again guys, I love you guys so much. I'm gonna try to take care of my husband. I'm only one person. And I'm gonna get back to you when he's in the bed or when he's eating. Have to make him eat, man. Just a little bit. Love you guys. My baby's up, guys. He's taking his coat off. Hi. Tell them. <laughs> How you know, guys? I'm happy. I'm so happy that we're doing the photo shoot today. Really? I couldn't make it. I literally couldn't make it. My body was done right now. I'm super messed up right now. But we're here for the night. Hopefully, they can fix the heat tomorrow. We have a fireplace here. Hey. <laughs> so I, nice, nice. I like it. It's very decent. But guys, I'm messed up right now, man. I'm all of it. I gotta take care of myself right now, guys. Yep, we gotta help him. He got his food. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna take it right now, baby. And um, he has his medicine. He's ready, guys. That's all that matters. A lot of food, baby. Good. I yeah. bought you large because I know you're not gonna eat much now. You mm -hmm. can eat some later. And I have the appetite to eat, but. Um, we got a kitchen. Just a little bit, yeah. We can cook if we want. Uh huh. And microwave. Mm -hmm. Heat up. Make up the popcorn. It's, it's like a home right here. Yeah, it's like a home. And Daddy, look at the okay. popcorn right here. Okay. All right, guys. So I'm going to keep you guys updated on how he is feeling. Hey, London. How are you feeling? Good. Good. How do you like the hotel? It's nice. Yeah. Nice. I love you. Eat a little bit. Eat, Come on. All right, guys. Let me talk to you guys. Guys, he can't eat. So, again, I'm going to try to get off this camera and make sure he eats a little something. I think I think I got him some soda and water to see if the soda can help him. I love you guys so much. I'm going to talk to you guys soon. That don't feel good. You going to take care of him? Aww. Guys, they sad. Cause if you guys know Shane, he's the energizing bunny. I'm still sick, but I'm not in that stage anymore. The last time I thought my legs were gonna fall off, I would have rather gave birth 20 times. I had the worst fever in my body. 
Ugh, it was horrible. Worst pain in my life. It was just horrible. I love you guys. I'm gonna keep on and off with this vlogging. I'll get back to you guys soon. I'm trying to get him in bed. Good morning, Lord family. It's your boy Shane. I'm feeling a lot better right now. This is the morning time. Yesterday, guys, my head was killing me. I couldn't focus. I just want. I just want to go to sleep. I could barely even stand up, barely even walk. The pressure in my head was just crazy. But today I'm feeling a lot better, and I'm super happy for that. I feel like I could jump, I could run. I feel like I could scream right now. So those are simple stuff that we take for granted, guys. And me being sick, it's a lot of stuff I take for granted. So now I'm gonna appreciate the simple fact that I could talk to you guys right now. My head is not hurting. I could jump. I could do all that. I'm so I'm super happy right now, guys. And um, listen. Still gonna drop video for you guys. We're still gonna do what do what we have to do today. We're still up. We're gonna do our photo and shoot, play. and we could play, right, Scarlett? Yeah. We got Scarlett in the building. Can I, can I tell them how many more days until my? Sure, family? go ahead. So guys, there's only three more days, and tomorrow there's two more days until my mom sees his son. And she oh yeah. The baby. Yeah, the baby's gonna be here in three more days. Three more days, guys, and our baby boy is here. So we're super excited. How you feeling, baby? The last three days been kicking your ass, right? It's been a long day, then it's soon come. It's hard to sleep, so it's cool. I'm ready. You ready? I'm yeah. ready to see how the baby destroyed me, too. You are a trooper, baby. To, to be honest, the way you carry this baby for all these months, and the way you keep doing it, going through the pain, can't sleep at night and stuff like that. But well, guess what? Three more days and the baby's out. And then he pisses me off so much already. <laughs> The way he's positioned is just like, why do you want to sleep like that? Yeah. He keeps waking me. He keeps like putting his foot in my. I don't know what bone that is, but it just hurts it's so sorry. much. He, every time I fall asleep, he does it. He's like, no, mommy, can you sleep? Guys, my baby can't sleep at night. Every time I turn, she's up, uncomfortable. She can't sleep. She's in pain. It's like, I know it's really hard, man, so. Three more days, baby's out. No, Let us hope that this baby's gonna cry, baby, like scold it. Because on top of that, it's gonna be really hard. Yeah. For a baby to cry, cry, cry every second, scold was really, really bad. So, guys, how you feeling? Y'all feel sick no more, right? Um, the left side of my throat hurts really bad. Okay. But I don't feel sick too. I don't feel like my yeah. body's sick too much. Yeah, it's just that I was in my entire body was in pain so that my head was just super, super crazy. But now, I feel happy. You, you guys don't understand how happy I feel right now, man. I wake up happy. I'm like, listen, no headache. The best feeling ever. Yeah, my throat don't bother me no like more. What, six o'clock? I went to sleep really early yesterday. Like six o'clock, and he woke up like eight. Yeah, and guys, the heat company, the, the gas company, they're going to our house to put a gas right now. Wait, the doors are locked? No, um, the gas is outside. outside. Oh. So they're going to change the gas right now in our house. So we're going to go home today. We're going to have heat in our home finally. Finally! So we don't have to stay in the hotel no more. But guys, it happened, you know? It's one of them days where um we, we have to move. <laughs> so, right, but, we're not moving for another like But we we'll live and we we'll learn. And London school is a delay. She can two start hours. two hours delay for her because they gotta like plow the snow and stuff like that. So I have to call a company to like clean my snow for my driveway. For my driveway. Driveway. Dri you said driveway. <laughs> Say driveway. So I have to call a company, company to clean the snow for our driveway, and um, that's it. That's about it. So today we have the photo shoot later on. So we're still gonna vlog and show you guys the photo shoot, the behind the scene and stuff like that. So stay tuned. We will show you guys everything. But celebrate life, man. Celebrate health. I'm happy right now, and nothing can take us happiness away from me right now. Unless All right. Not I'm not gonna get sick again. I think that's it. It knocked me down for one day, which is yesterday, and it's over right now. So. We're going to talk to y'all later. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. We want you to like, share, share subscribe, and stay tuned for the next bit of jumping. Have a very happy vlogmas. Have a happy, very happy vlogmas. A, a very happy vlog. <laughs> Peace out.